Should be a good weekend for Chile as the weather will be cooling off. We almost got to 70 today, but that's all starting to go away. It's tied in with the rain showers that we're getting right now. We saw these enter the area late this afternoon. But we're now seeing them exit briefly. We will have more rain showers on and off throughout the day tomorrow, but thankfully it's not going to be like last week. Last week between Wednesday and Saturday, we picked up nearly four inches of rainfall. Less than a quarter of an inch expected of between today and tomorrow. So very, very light rain amounts, even though the showers are pretty steady right now. Uh, so the rest of the night, scattered rain, much warmer temperatures up into the low 50s. We can thank some warm air rolling in today as well as some cloud cover for that. But likely the warmest night we'll see in a while as we do have another cold front coming through. So that kick starts our cooling trend for the rest of the weekend. So that's uh, the that's what's driving the shower activity we have right now. What's going to happen here is as this low pressure moves past us. You can see how spotty the rain is behind it. We're going to have that kind of activity tomorrow. So as you look at future track, low moves by and we're seeing a lot of uh, precipitation wrap around behind the low pressure system. And that's what's causing some of that spotty activity. It's not going to be nearly as steady because we don't have a good front driving it along. So spotty rain tomorrow that is out by the time we get to tomorrow night. Dry day ahead for th uh, Friday, but then Friday night this fast moving next weather system may bring in a a chance for some hit or miss rain going into Friday night should be out of our hair by the time we get to Saturday. So uh, our next couple rain chances tied in to a couple of fast moving weather systems. Uh, zooming in more to a local view here. Let's break down tomorrow. Spotty rain in the morning. As you'll see, we get uh, probably our steadiest showers right at about sunrise. They're gone pretty quickly and then we're back to this very hit or miss rainfall by the middle of the morning. May catch a break around lunchtime and then in the afternoon more of that spotty rain. You can see how much dry time will have, but every so often it'll have just a little rain shower activity sprinkle in over the area. And that's all again tied into just where we are in relation to that low pressure. By the time we get to Thursday night, we're drying out again. They keep in mind dry Friday, Friday night could have one last round of rain. Temperature starting to cool off. But we don't drop to chilly levels just yet. 60 degrees coming for tomorrow, and then we'll hold on to the 60s again on Friday. Next cold front, though, gets us down into the mid 50s over the weekend with some frosty nights. We do see a lot of sunshine, though. We rebound back to the 60s next week, but in your most accurate 10 day forecast, Wednesday and Thursday could have some soaking rainfall. And then just don't look at the end of the 10 day forecast, uh, getting awfully brisk by next weekend. And the four degree guarantee, we were four off yesterday, just clinging to the dartboard, hit it dead on today. That means cash total up to 65.